Hi friends, this is Mahmoud Sheikh and from past few videos, I am working on developing a classified website using PHP is one of the widely used framework Laravel. In my last video, I created the user's controller and I successfully managed to call our custom view which is users. Okay, I have created a user view um, and this is the view where which I am showing here. Okay, so now in this video. I will discuss about creating this kind of navigation menu uh, in Laravel okay I will change this simple navigation to something like this okay uh, so for doing that first we need to go to our project okay and we need to come to our resources folder inside resources folder we need to click on views inside views we will open layouts inside layout we will find app dot app dot .php file okay so whatever you are seeing here on this navigation menu all this comes from this app dot dot .php file okay so if i want to change the title or the logo i can change it from here here add zone copy okay just here okay let's refresh the page okay yeah let's just remove it paste it here okay and refresh the page you will see the logo name gets changed okay and i will change the color as well style background rgb 159 25 and 50 important save it okay and refresh okay now you can see the color or background color of our navigation gets changed okay and now we need to change the color to white and font size to 28 pixel save it okay and now we need to bring this uh, list options login and register from extreme right end to the left end okay so that exactly the way i have displayed here okay or uh, i need to display the these links in this way okay, so for that i will come here inside the container Okay, I will create a div with a class of column lg2. Okay, and then I'll create one more div with a class of 10 columns. Okay, and inside this columns i will two column i will create one more view with a class of row okay and here as well okay and then inside this row i will create further two sections two columns view okay copy which here and first first of four columns okay copy and then second one eight columns okay and now here inside this uh, second uh, two columns row i will first uh, first let me just delete it okay i will cut it out and i will put it here save it okay let's just refresh okay then i will take this list or your links register and login links i will just take it uh, cut it out and i will put it here okay okay save it now let's refresh 
and you can see these links are displaying on the left side okay now <coughs> We will create one more link. Okay. A href. Okay. And this third link is of add post link. Okay. And style color white okay, copy this and put it here okay and here as well okay save it and refresh okay now we need to bring this uh, add post link a little bit down for that what i will do i will just type style margin top 9 pixel okay and here i need to take out the text decoration none okay see our border is displaying here whenever i hover the mouse cursor on the link now let me see okay so everything is display uh, everything is working perfectly fine okay now uh, now our first section is over okay next okay, next we need to come to our second section which is our ten, column 10 section okay and here we need to come to our fourth column and here we need to create a form Plus form horizontal okay method post and then action okay next okay. then we need to create one more view with a class of form group row okay inside this we will create i will create one more view with a class of column okay now I save it and then just okay column this one is eight column okay and i will create one more column of size four save it and refresh okay nothing happens because i have not added any element inside in any column okay so now here we'll create input of type text name search on product okay and then class form control and then place folder enter product save it okay and then in the fourth column i will create button input type submit name Then save it now let's refresh the page okay now it's displaying text box and a button okay and a class class is btn btn default okay let's refresh okay then uh, for now our product text box and search text box gets completed and now we need to create this search by location text box okay for that we need to come to our to our eight columns here okay, and here again we need to create a form so 
sorry form okay let me just copy this and paste it here okay and then do with the class of form group okay the same do i need to copy and paste okay and then i will create a column Do the class of column LG six okay and copy and this one is of four column okay in the first column I'll create an input box type of type text whose name will be states okay and then id will be state okay and then class class will be form control okay and yeah and placeholder placeholder will be enter state or yes enter state okay and here in the fourth column i will create oh do oh, select okay because here I'll save it let me just refresh okay and now this text box is over and now i need to create this uh, drop down inside which i need to display the list of categories okay uh, now let's create that okay, select okay class form control drop down okay and then id will be categories class will be categories okay now uh, this four columns is also over and now we will create one more view of two columns to display the submit button okay input type submit okay then name search ads search ads okay and then class btn btn default okay and then value will be search okay here in for this button i have not set the value field value search here as well okay save it okay now let's refresh okay now you can see uh, i have a text box to enter the product and a search button to search a uh, text box for entering the state and a drop down for selecting the categories okay so let me, let me just put an option okay so i'm not going to type the categories here because i'm fetching this i'm fetching the categories for this drop down from the database okay now let me just come here okay i need to bring these all these elements little bit down so what i will do is i will type style margin top 5 pixel okay copy and then put it here here as well 
okay and then here as well okay yeah that's all save it now let's refresh okay so uh, now we have created our navigation navigation menu with uh, text box to enter the product name of the product and to search a text box to enter uh, the name of the state and then a drop down to select the categories okay so uh, in this video we saw how to create this navigation menu okay so it's almost similar to the navigation menu which i have created in my add zone classified website okay so now in the next video uh, we will move on further ahead to develop the next functionality of our add zone website okay so that's all for this video guys i hope you like this video i hope you got some useful and valuable information out of this video if you like this video click on like button share it with your with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching